It will be very, very useful for, for children, in particular children with epilepsy. It will be very, very useful for other people who can't keep still, like people with Parkinson's disease or movement disorders. And it will be very, very useful in mental health, people with mental health problems. What we do, we measure magnetic fields outside your head at the scalp surface that are generated by electrical current flow inside your brain. So in that way, we can then mathematically reconstruct those fields to be able to tell at any one moment what your brain is doing. For the first time, we can envisage scanning people in, as far as we can, natural environments. We can start thinking about how the brain responds to normal social interactions. You can't do that inside a conventional brain scanner.